What up, what up? We're here with the Baseball Bat Bros, and today, folks, we've been wanting to do this test for a long time. We have a Japanese high school baseball bat. This is one of the most popular ones, apparently, the Mizuno V-Kong 2. And we're gonna see how it compares with our regular baseballs we use to an American high school baseball bat. This is the Mizuno Hot Metal, both one-piece alloys, and they're actually different performance standards. They don't have BB core. I think it might be similar. Their bats actually got dampened back in 2020, I believe, similar to how these got dampened back in like 2011. They even have different baseballs they use in Japan. We have some of those as well to compare. And we're gonna see what's hotter, folks. The Japanese Mizuno or the American Mizuno. Let's get it. All right, folks, so I've been doing some research and there is next to zero information about the difference between uh, a Japanese high school baseball bat and an American high school baseball bat. There's one study done clear back in 2004 in the Beezer era, and apparently those old school high school Japanese bats were a little hotter than their American counterparts. But today, guys, I have no idea. So we're gonna try them both out, both 33 inches, and I think they're both 30 ounces. I can't really tell. And we'll give you an up close comparison of everything here. So here's the end caps, very different look. Looking. That's almost like a cupped kind of caved in end cap there on the Mizuno. The barrel profiles themselves are actually very similar, but the big difference here is the taper and the knob, as you can see on the American bat versus the Japanese bat. I am beyond curious if I had to guess, I think the Mizuno is going to win, but let's try it out. All right, so we're going to start out here with an American high school baseball, the NFHS stamp right there. These are the Champro balls we typically use, and we had to pull some strings for this, but we got the official Mizuno Victory high school baseball. And look at how these things come packaged, bro wrapped in aluminum foil all right so I, I don't know if that's for like humidity control or what but pretty cool the jaba and this is technically supposed to be a slightly smaller and a tiny bit lighter baseball than its american counterpart you can kind of actually tell uh but i have no idea if they're harder if they fly better that'll all be up to the rap soda right there we'll see all right we have the pitching machine here to keep everything controlled and consistent the rap soda to track exit velocity and new field today we're out here at vince Gena stadium in bend oregon home of the bend elks so the v-kong will go second we're going to start out with the american mizuno hot metal one piece alloy loud oh i'm so curious to see the sound difference bro i think the sound on that's going to be crazy This should be around 98. 97.3. Oh, I'm good. Decent barrel. Let's see how it carries. Oh, all right, right on the track. Ah, oh, my bad. That's a pretty good barrel. We're getting there. That'll be in the hundreds. Oh, we're on the fence. 100.5. Yeah, there we go. Good barrel. 101.2. Yeah. yeah. Good barrel. Yeah! 97.6. I should get out. See ya. Oh my goodness, that was a bomb. This one says 400. Oh, right off the side. Yeah, that was, I didn't hit that very good. <laughs> Get out! Ball. Go ball! Woo! Oh, All right, that's four that's pretty good barrel. Four eleven. Four eleven. The ball flies here, dude. All right, let's go. All right, Japanese bat, American baseballs. This is the first time ever the baseball bat bros have swung with the Japanese metal bat. The sound reveal will tell a lot. Let's see. First swing, the geese are stoked. I don't think I swung that hard either. Okay, we can't say it's hotter though yet. Oh, this, this sounds nuts. That hit the scoreboard. Are you kidding me? Okay, bro, let's see what happens here. Dude, I think it's heavier. It feels more end loaded. Dude, I think this is gonna be hotter, bro. I know that was hotter. 106.5. Oh! Wow. I knew off the bat. It's like a beast, sir. That's crazy. Oh my gosh, dude. That was not perfect, perfect. Oh my gosh. That was pretty good barrel. 
It's amazing! It's so good! Holy cow, bro! 104.3! It's so good! Dude, this feels like I'm hitting with a beaser. 106. Yep. Ooh. Holy wow. It's gonna be 104, 105 again. 104.7. Yeah. Oh, it's wow. so hot. That's 105. Yeah, the barrel's huge. Oh, that's way off the hands. That's stung. Bro. It is so good. See ya. It, oh my God. Over the trees. This is unreal. Did Bro. not see this coming. Nah, I hit it too low. Dude, that guy got so fast. 107. <laughs> 107. Oh Casual 1057. It's heavy. Like, it's super end loaded. Oh my God. Dude, that was so far. What a blowout. So not what I was expecting. All right, let's see if the Japanese baseball is harder or softer than an American baseball, because the bat's way hotter. All right, so we're moving to these now. Oh, they feel harder. Harder. They feel harder. I'm gonna hit 110. Oh. Oh my God. Wow. Wow. They're so good. 110. 110. Dude, Shohei hitting with this bat and these balls 125, 130 miles an hour, honestly. Bro, we got to get Otani swinging the V-Kong. Oh, my God. Flicked it. Wow. <laughs> outside at 100 miles an hour. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, bro. We're looking God. at potential 100. 110.3. 110.3. I was going to say, that was like 112, maybe. Oh. See you, ball. That's going to be on the roof. Oh my gosh, it's so far. Roof! Yeah. 101.8. 110 miles an hour. We'll try just for fun. This is one of the more conclusive results we've ever had. American bat, Japanese balls. It's so, dude, it's not even close. 103.3. Yeah. Oh, oh perfect, perfect, bro. Perfect, perfect. 103.9. A six mile an hour win. A six mile an hour win. Oh, oh I hammered that. Go ball. Go ball. Oh my gosh, Will. Dude, I can't even hit it harder than that. 102.6. Wow. Not even close. All right, one more for good measure. Get 112 with that back. V-Kong, baby. The best. Oh, off the hands. Off the hand, but why? Gone. <laughs> one of the best bats I've ever swung on the channel. One of the best bats I've ever swung. Oh. It's the best, bro. It's the freaking best. <laughs> Crazy. An absolute slaughtering by the Japanese bat. All right, so here's that last one. Max of 110.3. That, that's one of the hottest bats we've hit with, man. All right, so that was one of the most conclusive exit velo tests we've ever done. Uh, I thought it was actually going to be close. I thought there was going to be some nuance. There was not. This is one of the best, hottest bats I've ever hit with, man. The sweet spot felt incredible. It sounded sick. And the exit velos were, dude, honestly, five to seven miles an hour hotter. We'll be conservative, three to six miles an hour hotter. And not to mention the baseballs here, even hotter than the American baseballs. If we do another Guinness World Record attempt, I honestly think we need to consider trying these Japanese baseballs and the V-Kong here. So if you guys liked the video, make sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel. That was one of the funnest ones we've made in a while. If this was a BB core, this would be number one, not even close.